You Can Count On continues with Glenn Marini's Sports Report. There was no shortage of teams that could have brought home Team of the Week. Angola Girls Golf winning its first sectional. Wayne Girls Soccer off to a great start. And of course, Dwinger Football has won three straight games of the week. But still, we go with the streak snapper. After losing 20 in a row, Northside beating Bishop Lures on Friday night in dramatic fashion, 52-49. to And we're proud to honor the legends as your Optimum Performance Sports Team of the Week. I'm Jason Russell from Optimum Performance Sports. Ops is proud to sponsor this week's Team of the Week. Congrats on your victory. You are the new standard. We're out here at Northside High School. They earned their first win in over two years. Joined by head coach Mike Brevard. They were certainly kind of emotional after that win. What did it mean to you to get that first win under your belt? I mean, I really was more so excited for the team. I know these guys have been grinding and, you know, last year going 0-10 and not tasting the victory and then tasting it, you know, last Friday. I was more excited for them to get it. To put up 52 points in that victory, what were the keys to success on Friday night? It just came down to executing. I mean, like we told the kids, like we run the same plays, you know, from week one to week four. But the, the difference last Friday was that they finally, you know, they finally did their job. And like I told the kids, it's 11 individual matchups. Win yours. When you took over the program last year, you certainly changed the culture a little bit. But having a tangible win, how much can that mean for a program? I mean, I think it's huge. It gives you a little momentum, you know, definitely going into, you know, homestead week. But like I told them, it's time for us to hit the reset button, you know, back to the grind. And we're just going to prep like we're like a zero zero. Uh, obviously, this team has now got that victory. What can it do the rest of the year? I mean, I think he's kind of said it before that it, it does, you know, provide that stepping stone. But, you know, also reiterating that, you know, we're going to take it week by week and, you know, we'll, we'll deal with uh, future opponents when we get there. Describe this group behind you. What, what do they mean to you and what kind of are they? <laughs> That's a hard question. <laughs> Man, here, here, y'all go. I mean, I mean, I, I definitely, you know, my hat goes off to these kids because last year you coming in, I mean, they, they, they felt a different style of leadership, and for these guys to, you know, come back out, especially after what we put them through, and like I told, uh, you know, the reporter before that everything was about accountability. I didn't care about wins and losses last year, and they know that for a fact. You know, they did a lot of, a lot of running. We focused on that classroom, and you know, now to see, you know, kind of the. Uh, the, the hard work paying off, you know, it means a lot. We're here with the Legends, and they earned their first victory, so we're going to have them go 15 yards only on one leg. So here we go, 15 yards. I'm standing at the finish line. On your marks, get set, go. One leg. Oh, that's good right here. Yes, sir, right there, champion. Right there, yes, sir. So what did it mean for you guys on Friday night to get that victory? It meant the world to us. I mean, I like this team, how we execute, play together. We finally came together and got the dub. I like how we played. You feel a little bounce in your step, you could say, after that win? I yeah, I do, totally. What's it about this team? Can you describe this squad a little bit? I mean, I love these kids. I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what can this win do for this team moving forward? It could uh, do a lot for us, give us motivation, give us an extra step to success. All right, congrats <laughs> to the Northside Legends, your team of the week. Gotta feel good for Coach Brevard and those legends. Of course, you can nominate your team for Team of the Week by going to the Wayne.com sports page and clicking on the Team of the Week submission button. Hey, that'll do it for sports. We're back in two.